The University of the West Indies Seismic Research Centre is the foremost authority on earthquakes and volcanoes in the English-speaking Eastern Caribbean. Providing contributing governments with the information on these hazards, we aim to help persons mitigate the hazardous effects of geologic activity. With over 60 stations, the UESRC operates the largest seismic network in the Caribbean and also manages the Montserrat Volcano Observatory. The Seismic Research Centre is an agency for monitoring earthquakes in the English-speaking Caribbean from Trinidad in the south to St. Kitts in the north. It came about because there was a demand and a need for a resident team of scientists who had some level of expertise in monitoring volcanoes and provide advice as regards what was happening with these hazards that could potentially impact people. So in an organization like Seismic, you have to have a range of disciplines really to get what you want. We are scientists using techniques. It means that you have to have technicians who know how to make the instruments work. Um, we have to have computer engineers who know how to drive the software. So you have to have a range of skills. So we have a technical section with seismology technicians and they are responsible for having the data collected and processed. How we monitor volcanoes are a number of techniques that are used. The key to seismology, locating earthquakes, that are associated with volcanoes. Second way is to do ground deformation. So when a volcano is showing signs of activity, it changes shape and changes to the shape of the volcano is monitored. And the third way is the one that I'm directly involved in and that's using the chemistry of the volcanoes. So we look at the chemistry of the waters and the gases that are emitted at hydrothermal system over time. Electronic department is like the core or the heart of the operation of SRC. We have numerous stations and those stations are there to monitor the islands. Whether it's volcanic activity or tectonic activity, we'll be able to determine from these um, seismometers, these sensors, when something is happening. The education and outreach section of the Seismic Research Centre is essentially responsible for serving as the bridge between the scientists and the public. Seismic's existence is important for ensuring that we can live safely in the hazardous environment that we exist in in the Caribbean. Our outreach activities are not limited to Trinidad and Tobago, but we do regional activities as well. Uh, we have two standard ones that we've been doing for several years now. St. Vincent's Volcano Awareness Week is held every April to commemorate the 1979 eruption of the Sufre Volcano. And we've also been partnering with the Disaster Management Agency in Barbados to hold Tsunami Smart Activities every year around Carib Wave, which is held in March. The Seismic Research Centre has a very small complement of postgraduate students enrolled with us. Four degrees both MPhil and PhD in seismology and volcanology. We're constantly looking for partnerships that allows us to advance research and research projects that look at particular areas. We have a big program to grow the amount of geoscientists in, in the region um, who are experts in volcanoes and earthquakes and tsunamis. So, for example, we've had projects ongoing in St. Vincent which involve collaboration with colleagues in the UK from University of East Anglia, from Oxford, from Cambridge, from various places, that have had us had a research student who is looking at how magmatic systems evolve throughout the Caribbean. This helps us to train the new sets of geoscientists, the learning techniques that would help them to get a job later on apart from in research, but also overall they come out of that product that would help us as an institution guide governments to better plan for and prepare for hazards in the future.